this is task 4 and here we have to consider the following number presented in IEEE single precision 32 bits and we have to determine the sign bit the exponent and the significant or the mantissa m and determine the value of x which is the number the value of the number in decimal so here we are given two numbers here two binary numbers and we have to convert them to decimal numbers and we have to also write down the sign bits exponent bits and the mantissa so let's start working on that first um, let me write down the number the binary number which is 0 1 1 0 1 0 1 1 that's for the exponent and then you have here 0 1 1 0 1 0 1 and you have 0 0 0 0 0 and 0 okay so you have your sign bit and your mantissa sorry the exponent 8 bits and then your mantissa so now the first thing we need to do is we need to uh, write down the sign bit here so for sign we have the sign bit is 0 here which means it's a positive number and then we have to write the exponent bits so that's 1 1 0 1 0 1 1 which is in decimal numbers I hope you know how to convert it so it will be just um, here the place values are 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 so what we do is we add all the one positions here values of those so we have 2 to the power 6 plus 2 to the power 5 plus 2 to the power 3 plus 2 to the power 1 plus 2 to the power 0 and that will give us 215 here in decimal number and then now let us write down the mantissa so the mantissa is this number here which is 0 1 1 0 1 0 1 and then we have all the zeros filled in so this one here if you convert it to decimal you will have so just let me write down here so here these are after a decimal point so the position values are accordingly so this would be minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 minus 4 minus 5 minus 6 minus 7 minus 8 and so on so what we do is we add here the one positions which is 2 to the power minus 2 plus 2 to the power minus 3 plus 2 to the power minus 5 plus 2 to the power minus 7 and that gives us the value 0 0.414 and now finding the value in decimal so the value in decimal which is our x would have a formula which is minus 1 to the power s times 
1 plus the mantissa times 2 to the power the exponent minus bias okay so here we have minus 1 and the sine bit is 0 and here we have 1 plus the mantissa which is 0 0.4140625 times 2 to the power our exponent is 215 minus the bias is 127 and minus 1 to the power 0 is 1 times we have 1 plus this number here will be 1.0 no, 1 1.41 Four zero six two five times two to the power eighty eight, and this one here is equal to four point three seven six three one one four. Six seven times ten to the power twenty six. So that's the final answer for part A. And now let's look at part B. So I'll write down the binary number again here. So we have one for the sine bit, and then we have one zero zero. 11001 one, for the exponent and then we have here 0 1 1 1 1 1 5 ones here and then we have three zeros and then we have here one and the rest is all zeros so here we have now 2 3 4 Okay, so now we are done writing the binary number from the question itself and we have to now write the sine bit which is equal to 1 which means it's a negative number. So, yep. It's a negative number and then we have to write down the exponent which is one zero zero one one zero zero one and this in decimal numbers is equal to one hundred fifty three and then we have to write down the mantissa which is equal to this number here so we'll just um, write it with the decimal in front maybe so it's clear about the position values so we have here five ones three zero one zeros all of them and this one if you convert it you get the value zero point four eight five three five one five six two five okay now the value for x is minus one to the power s times one plus the mantissa times two to the power exponent minus the bias which is 127 for this case so we have here minus 1 to the power 1 as the sign bit and then we have here 1 plus the mantissa which is 0 
six two five times two to the power one fifty three minus one twenty seven. So this here is minus one times one point four eight five three five to five times two to the power twenty six and this here if you convert if you put it down to your calculator you will get the value as Get here ninety nine six eight zero two five five point nine seven. So you could leave the number like this, or you can make it normalized by saying minus nine point nine six eight zero two five five nine seven so you have made the number you have pulled the decimal number one two, two. seven steps so it will be ten to the power seven and that's the final answer for the part b of task four